what's going on guys welcome back to the channel <clears throat> so as you see in the title of today's video we're gonna be doing another saw review with the same three saws that we did in our last tool review um, we had a great outcome on the last video but we did have some comments and some concerns so basically some of the comments were saying that we didn't have the high output battery on the cobalt so we we got the high output fully charged it um, we have all, they also had another comment that didn't have a brand new blade on the craftsman so we went ahead, I'm going to flip y'all around in a second, but we put a brand new blade on the Craftsman, brand new blade on the Cobalt, and a brand new blade on the, the DeWalt, or pretty much brand new blade on the DeWalt. All these batteries are fully charged. I'm going to go ahead and flip y'all around real quick. So as you see, pretty much brand new blade on the DeWalt, fully charged 9 amp battery, which at 60 volt this is actually 3 amp, not to confuse y'all. High output battery, brand new blade, never had a cut on it yet. Fully charged, Craftsman, brand new blade fully charged 4.0 battery. <clears throat> so we're gonna do a few tests. We did uh, some two by six lumber last time. This time we found the dentist piece of lumber that we have. So these saws will be fully deep at two and a half inches, maxed out, full batteries, brand new blades. This is exactly what these saws can do to the max. <clears throat> we're gonna do uh, grain cuts. We're gonna do cross cuts. We're gonna do the ultimate output versus the 4.0 but since y'all wanted the best battery on the cobalt we'll do this test and then we're going to do best battery for craftsman versus best battery on cobalt versus best battery on the well almost best battery on the wall so let's go ahead and get started with our review the wall flex bolt halfway through okay wall flex bolt now we're going to do a grain cut on it. Let me, let me switch sides with you. Go ahead. Okay. There's your two tests for the DeWalt. Cobalt XTR, ultimate output battery. Okay. Grain cut. <laughs> okay. Now, Craftsman V20, 4.0 battery, fully charged, brand new blade. Yeah, you, you better move before I cut that cobalt in half. <laughs> <laughs> All right, grain cut. Okay, so there you have it with the 4.0 versus 4.0. You can actually see that the uh, the Craftsman and the Cobalt actually stopped at the same point, but the, the Cobalt does not want to go any further than this. The Craftsman does catch a second gear and it does finish all the way through. Same thing with the second cut. The Cobalt pretty much goes about six inches in and it pretty much has enough after that. It's not gonna go very much further. The Cobalt does have a safety mechanism in it. It cuts off if you put any, put any bind on it. However, the Craftsman does not. So now we're gonna do the 4.0 ultimate output versus the 9.0 battery. So brand new blades, best fully charged batteries for both saws. Ready? All right, Craftsman V20, 9.0 high energy battery. Yeah, that's a huge difference. Huge difference. Let's go back. Okay, flex vote. Okay. Yep, 9.0 versus 9.0. And now the biggest batteries, cobalt battery they have, ultimate output built for the XTR tool. Oh, it's not having it, guys. <laughs> so now that pretty much throws, I mean, we're still going to do our grain cuts, but that pretty much shows y'all the difference. That's impressive, dude. That's, That's impressive. Thing. Still got more power. Still got more power. Still got more bang for the buck. Yep. Still a joke. Yeah. So with the ultimate output battery, I would say that the cobalt is still great for your DIY guys. That's not gonna push the saws and use them to a high demand that we do. It's still a great budget saw. 
but if you already are into the craftsman line you cannot beat this tool for the money that 9.0 battery is insane it's literally running behind a 500 dollar saw so i mean you really can't beat that for the price at all um i mean that, that's that's pretty much everything you ask for guys brand new blades high output battery high output battery 4.0 versus 4.0 in the thickest hardest lumber that we have on the job site so there y'all go. Hopefully y'all enjoyed it. Thank y'all for watching. Drop y'all comments. Throw some likes. We appreciate y'all.